Well, my first summer job actually was at a uh, on a front desk in Niagara Falls, Canada, and if, you know, 16 years old, so it was uh, an eye-opening experience. And after about three summers, I fell in love with the business. What I love most about my job is just seeing, you know, what people do all day and accomplishing things and, and going out of the way to help people. That, that's what makes it exciting. You have to know your staff. And, and you know, we say that, it's, that's a canned answer, but you have to be genuine about it. And really that's what brings you back to work every day. Otherwise, it's just a building, it's just paint on the walls, carpet. And I always say to everyone, experience does not come from buildings. You can have the most beautiful building, but it comes from, comes from the staff that work for you. And you have to be there for it. You have to give them the experience. Working for Sheldon has definitely been an adventure. It's been one of the greatest experiences. I've learned so much from him. He has a wealth of knowledge of the industry and he has a really great way of motivating. I come from the entertainment side and the activities programming side and I've really learned a lot about how to really channel that into hospitality and how to make that the most effective way for guest satisfaction. I like the freedom that working with the team here offers. We get to be very creative in some of the opportunities that we have and, and just really being able to grow and stretch is uh, what I really enjoy about being able to work here. Sheldon is very passionate about what he does. He's passionate about the resort, he's passionate about us, he's passionate about the guest experience. Sheldon and I met in 2000 and I have one son and he has two daughters and a son. So we have like the Brady Bunch, but not so many. Our children are a blessing to us and we're so thankful for them. He loves his grandkids. The older ones are boys, they love to fish. Sheldon loves to take them fishing. And then now we've got some beautiful little granddaughters and he just loves to you know carry them around and it just puts the biggest smile on his face when he's hanging out with them. Sheldon's strength in our relationship and here is that he it tends to be super positive about everything like after the hurricane it was pretty devastating here but he envisioned already how it was going to be so much better afterwards. Sheldon is like that in our relationship as well. He's challenged by a challenge. So, you know, everyone asks, you know, how do you handle stress? You, know, you don't appear to be stressed. Well, I've just mastered being an actor. There's a little man runs around inside and it's like, ah! <laughs> you know? But in, in reality, I, I, I use running uh, as my personal time. And I love, absolutely have this disease called fishing that's incurable and I hope they never find a cure for it and to me that just gives me that time to reset. If Sheldon was an amenity here at the resort I would think he would be turned down service because he really at the end of the day wants to make sure everybody is uh, comfortable. If Sheldon was an amenity at the resort he would be the entertainment program in particular he would be Captain Hawk because fun fact Captain Hawk was Sheldon's idea. What an incredible honored to be you know, selected as you know, the incoming chair. And you know, it's something you never think about, you, know, you dream about, and, and uh, it's, it's really special. It really is special. And uh, I, I feel very, very honored and privileged to, to, to serve this organization.